All right, let's hit this double teeter tire. All right. I think it's just so slow. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was awesome. All right, we're at Hartman Creek State Park. Gonna hit the trails. All right, this is just the access section to the main trails. Never been here before, so it's kind of fun to hit something new. So Hartman Creek State Park is in Wapaka, Wisconsin. We stayed at Tina's brother's house last night and his wife, Debbie, her brother, Mark. Got to catch up a little bit on what's happening in their lives. Had a little bit of sprinkle this morning, but the trails look still relatively dry. So it's a lovely day out here. All right, so after about four tenths of a mile, we're here at the trailhead. Looks like we're gonna single track trailhead. Okay. All right, just getting started on the green. We've made the executive decision to take the short leg of green to blue so we can hit blue and possibly all of black. So the signage out here is actually pretty good. They've got the intersections marked off with some nice little signage. For me, it's uh, pretty easy to understand the signage. It does look like there's gonna be some sand in the trails. Right. Tina's nemesis. You can hear it sprinkling out, but under the canopy, it's, we're staying pretty dry actually. And we appear to be going up, up. Uh, this is where we're going to turn. Does it look like it's one way? More difficult. No, it's just this is... You said you were taking the second entrance. No. Okay. Um, you're right. We're going to take the next blue entrance. The next one? Yep. So you can see the signage there is actually pretty, uh, pretty clear. Oh, nice job getting through there. Trying to get my legs about me. There you go. This must be the other blue one. Can you can you say that again? What you said back at that last post? The signage? Yeah, it ain't happening. <laughs> your what? Yeah, I was I was recording at that point. <laughs> Let's go this way. I love it. All right, so this is where we're going to get on the blue single track. It's more difficult. And you Tina... said you're right. I heard it. <laughs> I did. Um, you're right. Um, you're right. Um, you're right. Um, you're right. Okay, we just got on the blue. Tina's leading the way. It's more difficult than the green. The trails are actually pretty scenic and uh, pretty well maintained, actually. Oh, a little trail candy there. Whoa, good save. You all right? A little wash out in the sand. A little more sand than we anticipated. Yeah, a bit more falling with style on that one. Yeah, though. you didn't even fall. You just yeah. stepped off the bike with style. There you go. Well done, honey. <laughs> so the sand is a little bit sticky because of the little bit of moisture we're getting. If you look at Tina's back tire, <laughs> The trails are really firm, so we're not doing any damage, but we're picking up a lot of sand on the tires, which kicks onto the backs of our legs <laughs> and trickles down into the shoes. <laughs> so needless to say, we'll probably have a little bit of momentum, mementos from the trail.
Good job there, Tina. Ah, somebody's been out here weed whacking. Nice little flow area. Some nice long stretches instead of just turning left and right all the time. Yeah. Oh, getting into the darker woods. Oh yeah. Oh, a narrow. Oh, made it. Oh, yep. Oh, this is a cool little ravine. Right alongside. I see some climbing in our future. It goes down, let's come up. Yep. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but there's a little bit of thunder in the far distance. And it's moving away from us, which is nice. These trails were recommended to us by our friends Craig and Sue. They rode here a couple years ago and said we should check it out since we're going to be in Wapaka. And here we are. Thanks, Craig and Sue. Oh, well done. <laughs> so Tina and I were just talking about the climbs. They haven't been real bad. They seem to be pretty gradual. It's not like you get to the top of a climb and you're totally out of breath. They're actually pleasant, except for the, <laughs> as Tina said, the climbs with the sand that make you work a little more. But overall, they're pretty well designed and thought out climbs. Thunder in the distance. Tina ripping down the downhill. She's afraid to open it up because you never know when you're going to hit a big pile of sand. <laughs> like there. <laughs> Good save. Nice bench cut along the way here. Let's you give it a try. Oh. Ooh. Got So what do you think of this as a blue trail? Yeah. Okay. It's not too difficult. No. Be a more almost more like a green, wouldn't it? Oh the sand, yeah. Oh the sand makes it uh, more bluish. Okay, so we made it to the black trail. Which means we're almost done with blue. All right, Tina, so we're gonna start the black trail, 2.2 miles of torture. How do you feel about that? I will find ways around it. <laughs> so we're entering the black section. Let's see what they got to offer. Oh, it splits off here. Let's go to the right and see what happens.
didn't see that coming. So in case you're wondering, Tina decided not to do this section, so she's waiting back at the beginning of it for me. I'm told there's supposed to be a double teeter-totter on the black loop, so I'm guessing I'll be coming up to it shortly. Oh. I think I'm getting near the end of a black loop, and I haven't seen any double teeter-totters yet. Now the rain is coming. The double teeter totter. We should be able to do this. All right, let's hit this double teeter totter. That is slow going down. <sighs> All right, I thought it would go faster. All right. <sighs> I think it's just so slow. All right, back to Tina. Oh, yes. Ah, oh. uh, I do the rock, but it's wet. And raining. Alright, so we did some green, we did the whole blue loop, I did the black loop, and now we're coming back on the green loop. What's that? Yeah. So we're gonna be coming up on the end of the trail soon and taking the connector out back to the car. All right, looks like a root drop. Nice. And we are back to the trailhead. So the trails, you back to the, car? the surface of the trails are all pretty similar. Just that the, the blue has some features on it and the black has bigger features. How'd you enjoy that? The uh, trails themselves are pretty nice, well cared for. Yeah. The sand was a little bit uh, interesting. I can see a fat tire bike being much better through oh, the sand here, yeah. I would enjoy my fatty. Yeah. This is the connector trail back to the cars. I, I say cars. This is the connector trail back to the car. <laughs> All right, here we are. Back at the cars. Back at the car. <laughs> Looks like we're the only ones out enjoying the trails this morning. So even though we were rained on a little bit, it wasn't too bad under the trees. No. The trails needed a little water on them. 